Hey, what's up everybody? Here's another water comparison video. Tonight we're comparing these two waters. First up is Zephyr Hills from Florida versus Ozarka from Texas. These are both Nestle regional brands and we're going to start off by doing a comparison of their pH level. And so I've got two of them for each and four glasses of water because I'm going to do something a little different. I'm going to do two, e two pH tests of each brand. I want to show you me pouring them so you know it's real I'm doing two of each because I've got a ton of this water each brand and I was watching other people on YouTube do pH tests of these and the people on YouTube looked like they got different results for even the same brand so I'm just doing another test so I got two cases of each brand and uh, each of these bottles is from a different case. So we're gonna see if they have different results. So first up, Zephyr Hills. Let's see what we got. They look pretty close. Here's Ozarka. Just mix it up a little bit. look pretty close and uh, first of all if you're new to the channel I am colorblind so I'm gonna kind of leave it up to you guys to uh, look at the chart and make the final decision what you think the pH level is I'm actually pretty surprised by how different the two colors were and how different the pH levels were on these two waters because these are both Nestle regional brands and they're supposed to have like the same, you know, filtering process and same chemicals to filter these waters. So I sort of assumed that they would have the same pH level, but I guess because they're from different sources and they're from different areas, that actually would determine the pH level for these two waters. So yeah, these are regional brands from Nestle, like I said. In episode 5127, I reviewed Arrowhead water, which is also a regional Nestle brand that's on, you know, the California end of the country. And in episode 3,781, I reviewed Poland Springs, Deer Park, and Ice Mountain, which are on the East Coast and in the north of the United States. And finally, I'm going to review the last two Nestle regional brands, Zephyr Hills and Ozark. And this is going to complete my reviews of the Nestle regional brands. Ozark is from Texas. It says it's from Eureka Springs and it's uh, situated in the Ozark Mountains. So it's named after the Ozark Mountains but it's actually called Ozark. Uh, they put an extra A on the end of it for some reason. And the reason that I did two different cups for each brand is because the source of this water is Piney Woods Springs and or Moffett Springs and or Rohrer Springs. So the source of this single water is possibly from three separate areas. So I, I thought if I got different cases from each different area, the pH level might be different. And like I said, when I was watching YouTube videos of other people were doing the pH tests, some of them had slightly different, you know, pH levels. At least that's how it appeared to me. Zypher Hills is from Florida. Uh, they also sell it in Georgia sometimes. And the source is the Crystal Springs and or the Blue Springs in Florida. So I also did two tests because it's and or. So I don't know if this is from... Crystal Springs or from Blue Springs or if they mix them together I don't really know the shape of the two bottles is identical they probably use the same exact mold to create these and the text and like the branding of the bottles is very very similar like the wording of it all is very similar so let's open these up and just do a taste test comparison and I'll tell you which one I think tastes better A little bit funky. It's 
Sorry, Ozark. Yeah, when I reviewed the other Nestle Regional brands, they really tasted, you know, almost identical. Um, these two actually taste a little different. <laughs> like, I know which one's the winner already. This one has like, this one has like a plasticky taste to it. Um, I'm kind of shocked right now because, like I said, I was expecting these to taste exactly the same. I was expecting them to have the same exact pH level. And so, I'm a little bit shocked. Right now, the Ozark tastes a little bit better to me, but I've got two more. They're pretty small, so let's just try this one more time. Here's Ozark. Here's Zephyr Hills. Yeah. The Ozark water just tastes better to me, actually. I really have no reason to be biased here. In my opinion, Florida and Texas are pretty equal. Like, I don't really have a preference over one or the other. But the Ozark uh, water definitely tastes better. And this is definitely the winner. I think it's kind of a weird branding. How it's got the A on the end of it. Yeah, this one just has a weird taste to it. It's really weird. And like I said, I bought two cases of this. These two waters are from the two different cases. So it tastes funky with both cases. And so I didn't review these two waters really early on, like a thousand episodes ago, when I did the other regional brands, because I couldn't find them in any of my stores. These were only sold in the South. And so I got these because I actually found out that Walmart.com sells these and you can have them shipped to the store and pick them up so this is actually a pretty good deal it cost me like a dollar 90 cents or something like that they had to they had them shipped all the way across the country for a whole case of water um but i'm realizing that there's tons and tons of nestle brands because i was going through walmart's website and like it's pretty smart of Nestle to have so many different brands because if you search water, the, ma the majority of the results are from Nestle. Like, there's a huge list of different brands that they own. And um, I guess I'm betting people in Texas prefer Ozark and people in Florida just prefer Zephyr Hills. And um, I'm just reviewing it on the taste. And in my personal opinion, I think the Ozark tastes better, so it's the winner. So, thanks for watching, everyone.